This is a M Gateway MT6460 and we're going to add some thermal grease to the uh, CPU. Okay, before I start, uh, go ahead and throw me a bone and hit that subscribe button. And uh, leave a comment and leave it in the comments that you say I subscribed and I'll personally respond to your comments. All right. So let's start here. Let's uh first we got to remove the battery. Remember a couple videos ago, we replaced the CPU, but we didn't grease the, uh, we didn't add thermal grease. You got to push these buttons outward. Here's the main battery here. This button here over here, tab. Push these outward, and it should release. There it is. Now, we didn't add thermal grease last time we were in here. I just wanted to see if I could get the CPU running. This is the, this is the... This is our main, uh, what do you want to call this, uh, cover here on the back. Our CPU is right underneath here. And our fan, I'll show you how to blow out the fan too, blow the blow the lint out of there. Alright, just there's six screws here, they're all going to stay in when you loosen them. And then, they don't come all the way out. This is the, uh, uh, check out my playlist, I'll put a, descript I'll put a link in the uh, description, the playlist for the uh, M Gateway MT6460. This is, the, this is the laptop that we bought at the thrift store for $10, and I made some upgrades to it, you can check it out in the playlist. But right now we need to go back in and put that thermal grease on the, uh, on the CPU. Keep it from overheating. We upgraded the uh, we upgraded the CPU from an Athlon. It was a 1.7 megahertz Athlon, and we went up to uh, 2.0 Turion. It's called Turion X times two chip. It, it runs nice. It's running good. All right, that should be it there. Okay, on this middle one here, right here. It's got a K next to it. That's that's the keyboard. That one goes to the keyboard. You're just going to loosen it. We're just going to loosen it. We're going to leave it in there. That one can come out, but I don't want to lose it. All right, it's loose now. Should be get this up now. It's cover. All right. And, and, the, and the, that one screw, there it is hanging there. See there? That's a long screw for the keyboard. Just keep the cover tilted downward. Put it out of the way. I don't want to lose that, that one screw there. Alright, here's our here's our CPU under here. You have four screws. Here's the heat sink. And here's our fan. We gotta get the cover out from underneath this edge over here. This this cover here, it's gonna come out of, out of out of there. We're gonna lose these four screws here. And don't do one oh get just loosen them up a little bit at each each and go back and forth. There might be some old thermal grease underneath there from the old old uh, CPU that was there. I just wanted to uh, see if I could get the uh, computer laptop running. Might hear some thunder there in the background. Get some rain over here. Okay, I think we're loose. Okay, now you're going to lift it up on the left side first. And it's all going to come out as one piece. I lifted it off. I'm holding here in the middle. Now don't go too far because right here, right here, there's a spot where the it connects in for the uh, for the electric for the uh, fan. 
for the power for the fan and I don't want to re release that. I don't want to take that out. It's hard to put that back in. There's a cord there. So we don't want to pull it up too high. But we got to get it out from under this side over here. So you're going to pull it to the left a little bit. Until it comes loose over there. There it goes. And there's our wire. I'm just going to turn it a little bit. There's a wire here for the fan. See on the fan you're going to uh, just blow some air in the end over here. Blow some air in the end over here to get the, you'll see this fan start spinning when you blow it. You're going to get the dust out of here. And, and you want to look down in here. Let me turn this again. I found some lint down in here by the motherboard here underneath the fan last time I was in here. So you want to check there and get that out of there. Okay. Let's turn it back the way we had it. So we can get to the CPU over here. Now see I got some old, there's some old thermal grease on there from a, it's underneath the, uh, it's on the bottom side here of this gold thing, the, the heat, the heat sink. So I'm going to, I'm going to wipe it with a, I'm just wiping underneath the bottom side there. There it is, I'm there. That's the old thermal grease from the old chip that we had in there. I just wiped it with a Scott towel. And I'm going to wipe the cover of that one there, too. Alright. One more. Okay. I got this thermal grease. I got it at uh, microcenter.com. I don't think it'll show up on the... Uh, there it is. MX Arctic MX4 Thermal Compound. I'll leave a link for it in the description. Okay, let me get the lid off here. We're just going to put a little pea size on the chip there, right in the middle. This will give you, it'll probably work about 10 times, 10 different uh, laptops or, or, or chips here. So we're just going to put a little size of a pea here in the middle. That's it right there. That should be enough. Okay. You see that? And now you're just going to put the heat sink back down on there. And we're going to go back to the right side here and hook the right side underneath that underneath this plastic edge. We're going to put that underneath there first. There it goes. And then just lay it down over here on the, try to line up those screw, screws a little bit. Okay. Don't tighten them all down at once. Just, uh, just go about halfway and then tighten the other one. Cross, go cross ways. Go over here. And then move around. That's got it. And that's it. That's the, uh, that looks like it. All right, now we got to go back to the cover. Now on the cover, on these front edges, right about here and over here, there's going to be two here, but it's on the cover. You'll see there's a, there's like these little flanges, and you got to get them underneath there first. Okay, so you're going to put the cover down. Over on the right here. You want to do the back edge of the closest to you first. Okay, I got the one over here. There's one here. 
and I got and there's there's two there. And pull them in, and then push the back down. Should be able to get it now. And, then, and all these screws stayed in, remember? We had the one loose one here from the keyboard. It's still, still down there. There it is here. I'm going to make a video of, uh, we're going to start from scratch. And I'm going to show you how to do an, uh, a laptop. You get a laptop at the thrift store, 10, 20 bucks. I'm going to show you how to upgrade it all the way from the beginning. That's coming soon. So go ahead and like and subscribe. Basically, that's what we did with this one here. This one came from the thrift store. We, we already upgraded the CPU, the RAM, and uh, the Wi-Fi card. I showed you how to get in there, but I didn't upgrade it. That's it. There's about six of these around here. Okay. Now you just put the battery back in. It's like it, that's it. Now we just stick the battery back down there. Okay. Got it. Okay, like and subscribe. Uh, Gateway MT6460. We just put thermal grease in there. So that's it.